What's good, R&B squad? This is Heart of Ruth. I trust that this message meets you guys in good spirits. If you're new here, welcome. We don't believe that you're here by accident. We're happy to have you, and Jesus is even happier. So I'm going to share a dream that I had with you guys, and then I'm going to explain to you what the Lord conveyed with that dream, okay, for who this is for. In the dream, there was a young woman she seemed to be at an interview or she was waiting for an interview for a job okay and at the establishment where she was working there was this other woman who was already working there and the woman approached her after she had been sitting there for some time because she'd been waiting for a while to have this interview and after she had been sitting there for some time this woman approaches her and the woman, she tries to seem friendly, but I'm looking on, I'm watching what's happening. And I could see from off the bat that there is something very insincere about this lady, okay? So she goes to the young woman who is sitting there waiting for the interview, and she's not the person in charge. She's not the person in charge of hiring the young lady. She's not even conducting the interview. She's just an employee at the establishment at the moment, okay? And there was emphasis on that. But she says to this young lady, oh, anyone who applies for this job, they're not gonna get it because this company isn't taking on any new employees. So you might as well not bother. And then, to drive her point home, she takes the young lady outside and shows her a sign and says, okay, look at the sign. Do you see that? That is proof that this company is not taking on any new employees. They're not hiring. And then I woke up from the dream. And I sat with the Lord and I had the Lord explain to me what I saw. And this is how the Lord broke it down to me. The Lord said that there are many persons who are on the verge of their breakthrough and it can be for more than one thing, but particularly for kingdom marriage. For some persons right now in this season, your courtship is right around the corner. Your engagement is right around the corner. Your wedding is right around the corner. But the accuser of the brethren, the enemy is trying to make it appear as if it's not going to happen. Notice in the dream, this deceptive woman, she took this young lady outside, she showed her a sign, in quotation marks, okay? To prove that the company wasn't hiring anybody. All right, so at the moment, the enemy operating through other people, and sometimes he's gonna come himself, okay? is trying to deceive you, trying to show you false signs or deceptive signs. And I should add, in the dream, the sign didn't really have anything on it. There was nothing on there. There was no writing. There was nothing on there. But she was trying to convince this lady with this empty sign that the company was not hiring any new employees. So this is the same thing that the enemy is doing to you. You're in your season to come together with your kingdom spouse, whether it's for courtship or engagement or for marriage. And the enemy is trying to make you see all kinds of signs that are actually empty when you really examine them properly. But he's trying to prove to you that this thing isn't going to happen. So now you're thrown into a state of confusion because you're asking yourself and you're asking the Lord, but Lord, I thought you said so-and-so. So how come it looks like? Forget about what it looks like. That's the enemy trying to trick you and he will move through other people to try to trick you as well. Guys, I can't explain to you how deceitful this woman looked in this dream trying to convince this woman, this other woman that she wasn't gonna get the job. And for some of you, it's not just your kingdom spouse. It's an opportunity. It's an actual job opportunity. It's a move. It's something that the Lord is getting ready to do in your life. And the enemy is trying to make you think that it's not going to happen. Okay? But the Lord took me to Psalm 66 verse 19. But certainly God has heard me. He has attended to the voice of my prayer. The Lord has heard you. He's heard the cries of your heart. 
He is going to answer you. And this is your season for coming together with your kingdom spouse. This is your season for getting that breakthrough, that opportunity. All right. The door is wide open. Do not allow the enemy to deceive you in this time. I hope that word brought comfort to someone and I will be back with another word as soon as the Lord releases me. Take care.